On behalf of Expert Village, my name is Jason Sheridan from the Sheridan Fencing Academy here in New York City, and today we're going to demonstrate some intermediate saber fencing. Once we have these basics of forward and backward, we need to be able to combine this movement to be able to move effectively and efficaciously against an opponent. What this means is moving with change of rhythm so that we are not predictable about how we're going to move or when we're going to move or even where we're going to move next. The girls here will practice moving forward and backward. They will be changing the rhythm. Go ahead, girls. What this means is they're changing the size and the speed of their steps. They're changing the direction and they're being surprising in how they do that. Notice, for example, as they're moving also that they're staying very smooth and very relaxed. They're not being clunky, jerky. They're changing surprisingly. They're being unpredictable, but they're being relaxed. They're being smooth. As they move, they can also move their hands to different positions, changing their blade position, which we'll go over shortly.